this is Levi back with Obagon Homestead. I'm going to be showing you another video with my incubator. And it's locked down in four more days. So I just wanted to show you another video of my incubator. All right. Well, what are you going to be doing with it? Um, I am going to be checking the water and I'm, we're going to be candling the eggs. What's the temperature read right now? It is 30, that's 38. 37.9. 38. Now, now it's 38, I mean, you said 37. All right, so let's turn the lights off and let's candle them. We sort of already have an idea of what's going on because we've done this. And, uh... Yeah, let me turn off my water lamp. So... So, a bunch of these eggs. I won't actually eat. Never, uh, never did anything. They just, uh, they just didn't take off. I, I'm guessing maybe they were infertile, or maybe they had been uh, sitting on the shelf for too long. We're not really sure, but uh, we're pretty sure we know know exactly how many we have that are that are. Uh, viable at this point we're just going to show you guys and Usually, and we're actually going to get rid of these this time this one is actually warm but as you can see that there is just a yolk no chicken in there what day are we on levi um we are on right now we're on, yeah, we're on. 14 days So none of the, so none of the uh, Easter eggers, Levi, don't put those down. If they break, they're going to stink, probably. Yeah, me. Set them down easy. None of the Easter eggers took off and uh, started incubating. So I'm guessing, uh, I'm guessing they just weren't fertile for whatever reason. Just a yolk. You'll see one here in a minute that. You'll be able to see the difference. So that's like one of those chocolate eggs that we don't know. See how dark that egg is? It's very dark. Problem, problem with trying to see what's going on in this egg is, is the chicken is so big and also the uh, shell on this egg was really, really dark. Let's see if I can get it to where you can sort of see through part of it right there. You can barely, barely see through part of that egg. That, that's what it should look like by this time. Yeah, it wasn't that dark. Dark a couple of times that we checked it, but it was pretty dark. So we'll put that one back in. We're going to have to get rid of these eggs. But... And then you can see this one is about in the same stage. It's just completely dark. Very dark shell on this egg. There you go. You can see a little bit of see-through through it. I don't know if you can see that on the camera or not. But that's a good egg. I don't think it's anything wrong with this incubator. I think it's all got to do with uh, the eggs maybe of being old or just not fertile. For whatever reason. You can see that's just a... Just a yolk. But we'll get him another batch of eggs and uh, we'll do, we'll do, we'll continue this review on this Amazon incubator, Levi's next batch. So we had, um, how many, how many Easter eggers did we have, Levi? Um, there was 10 eggs in there so we had six e easter eggers in the incubator none of those took that's just a spoiled egg actually i did have like we, we had six easter eggers oh yeah we did have six and none of your easter eggers took off yeah but uh we had we had four of these brown eggs uh i'm thinking i'm thinking a couple of these brown eggs could have been 
copper baron eggs or something because they're so dark. But you can see that one's that one's got a, a lot going on in it as well. So so we're down to just three eggs in there, but, but three out of the four of the brown eggs took off and did well. So we're at set I, I would say we're, we're realistically at 75% right now. It's just uh, it's just that the problem is just that, like I said, the Easter eggers weren't fertile. But that's the, that's the low temperature alarm after checking it several times. Here in a minute, it'll uh, go away. All right, Levi. Tell them what you wanna, what you wanna incubate next. What do you wanna do? You wanna do chickens again, just to make sure your incubator's good, and then maybe uh, what do you wanna do after that? Quail. You wanna do quail? Yeah. Hello. And then once you once you mess with this incubator, it's really hard to see if you have the the uh, egg turner lined up so you, you can just power it off unplug it and plug it back in and it'll go through a test cycle on it i don't know what are you gonna do with three three chickens Levi? are they gonna be your pets or you gonna sell them i don't know i might keep one one I'll keep, I might keep one to show and keep two to, don't forget to like and subscribe, like and subscribe, so and, and wait, and wait, wait until next week to see the chicks hatch, and then, like, don't forget to like and subscribe.